Hundreds lined up eager to rally for Dan Maffei. Right in the middle was Stephanie Led. She watched Maffei solve tricky math problems in her pre-calculus class when he was a student at Nottingham High School nearly 30 years ago. And I have followed him for all these years, and he is a brilliant, thoughtful, sensitive person, and the kind of person you want to be in Washington solving problems for us. Like Led, everyone waving signs inside this rally wants Maffei to continue tackling problems such as affordable college tuition, starting public preschool, and economic growth in the middle class. That has been my central focus this entire time. We must create jobs, we must grow our economy, and we must strengthen our middle class. Maffei got some big time support from former President Bill Clinton. The election is about your future and whether we're going to grow and go forward together under Dan Maffei, we will. Re-elected. Clinton says our state has one of the steepest drop-offs in voting turnout during a midterm election. So in this tight race, he's asking everyone to avoid a drop-off by remembering to vote for Dan Maffei. What he loves about that job is when he saves somebody else's job or he gets somebody else a job or he gets somebody a better education. One topic discussed by both Bill Clinton and Dan Maffei was the importance of pay equality for women, a topic which is on the front burner for many voters during this campaign. Well, I definitely agree with equal pay for women. Um, I think it's difficult to figure out the best way to implement that, perhaps. We have many problems, and I would like to see him, I um, would be so glad if he were able to be, come back, go back to Washington and help solve some of the problems. Big time support to help reelect a problem solver. Reporting from Hancock Airport, I'm Alex Rasilla.